What's happening, everybody? How are we doing? How are we feeling? Welcome back to Fade to Drive. That's right, everybody. So, if you are a brand new uh, subscriber, viewer of mine, if this is one of my one of your first times watching one of my videos or live streams or whatever, you should be subscribed, especially if you are looking into being a Grubhub driver, uh, Uber Eats driver or courier service for anything, you know, Postmates, DoorDash, Caviar, any of these services, uh, you should be subscribed because I'm trying to put more money in your pocket. That's right, folks. So as I'm recording this, uh, this is a live stream as I'm recording it, but you may be seeing it as a video, which either way is fine. Um, so what I wanted to talk about today is I wanted to talk about uh, how much money you can earn as a Grubhub driver. Um, I've been doing this since the beginning of June 2017. Uh, right now it's October, towards the end of October, so it's been like, what, four months, five months, something like that. Um, there are a lot of factors that go into um, how much money you can make and how much money you can earn, whatever you want to call it, uh, with Grubhub. You have two options, for sure. One option is um, Grubhub has blocks, which are schedules you pick every week. Um, and you'll get like a minimum hourly rate um, as if you were just like an employee at you know any place you know where you get paid by the hour uh, where I am in New York it happens to be twelve dollars per hour so um, that's an, an option you can you know get paid through that and if your orders like tips and all that stuff exceed the hourly minimum you know you'll get more than the minimum that's how it works or you have the option, which Grubhub does not look too highly upon, but a lot of people do it, uh, where you just work, you know, you go online when you want. You know what I mean? When you're scheduled on a block, you have to honor that block and have to be online for that entire time because if you go offline during uh, the course of your block, they'll give you a warning and then if you keep doing it, they'll eventually terminate your partnership with Grubhub. Um, this does not apply to Uber Eats. Uh, Grubhub and DoorDash, I believe, are the only ones right now that are doing uh, like scheduled blocks, if you will. Um, but with that being said, uh, it really all depends. I mean, like I, I've touched on this in other videos in the past. Uh, which shifts are better to work? Is are the lunch shifts better? Are the dinner shifts better? Um, I'm gonna tell you right now, if you work a lunch shift, which is really like a lunch rush, which is like 11 to like two o'clock, uh, 11 in the morning till 2 p.m., you can make anywhere upwards of, you know, maybe $30 to $60, sometimes more. I've made up to $80 before. During the dinner rush, naturally you're gonna make a little more money because people are tending to order more food as opposed to maybe just one thing. They might be ordering multiple things, which, uh, you know, Grubhub will give you like, I think a percentage of that or something like that. If exactly, I'm not sure exactly how that works. But um, by doing so, you will, uh, you know, you'll definitely make more money. You have a better chance of making, you know, like $80 for dinner as opposed to maybe like only making 50 to 60 for lunch, you know, and, and upwards. But me, I work the whole day. I start at 11 and I usually work until about eight to nine at night. And some days, you know, I'm bringing in 130, $140. There have been days I made $180, you know, it's really about your market, how much people are ordering, how many drivers are on. There's a lot of things to, you know, keep in mind, a lot of things to consider. Uh, so I'm gonna start driving right over here. I'm, I was waiting a couple of minutes to go uh, pick up a Buffalo Wild Wings order. So I'm going to head over there now because I'm sure they're going to say it's ready for pickup any minute. But yeah, guys, I mean, Grubhub is, it's a blessing in disguise. It really is. Um, uh, you know, unfortunately, when you tell people that you do delivery and you deliver food full time, you know, people tend to judge you and whatnot. But the crazy thing is... If you're cleaning house, making 150, 160 dollars a day, you know, that's that's more money than a lot of people with college degrees make. You know, you know, depending on, of course, what job or what career. But really, when it all comes down to it, uh, the potential of these delivery services, because it's the future now. I mean, we are living in the future, where people can literally just order sh stuff. I was about to say another word. <laughs> 
try not to curse too much, where people can order stuff right from their phone, you know, while they're just laying around in their underwear at home. I mean, it's an, it's an amazing feature and it's only growing, you know, more and more of these companies are coming out because they're just seeing the potential. I mean, you know, even Uber, you know, Uber and Uber Eats. I mean, the fact that you can order a cab, you know, or order a ride right from your phone is incredible. It's awesome, you know, but now, like, like I said, more and more people are starting to work for Grubhub and more and more restaurants are starting to participate. Like recently KFC and Subway have now joined up with uh, with um, with Grubhub and they're popping up now. Like how McDonald's has the exclusive, you know, contract with Uber Eats. Um, they, they may eventually be on Grubhub, but I'm sure they're, you know, they're going to probably keep it just to Uber Eats for now. Uh, I'm going to get into Uber Eats in tomorrow's video and, and talk a little bit about how that works. But Ultimately, it really all depends. I know of some people that are making $200 a day every day. I have made $200 in a day, like once or twice, uh, you know, with a combination of Grubhub and cash tips. Um, but I got to tell you right now, jump on Grubhub as fast as you can. Uh, it's a very quick process. You know, I, I got approved, I think, in a couple of days. Some people, it's taken them up to a week. But uh, just go on Google and type in Grubhub for drivers application. They'll do a background check. Um, you know, they'll make sure that your car that you're using is, uh, you know, it's all registered and, and all that good stuff. But guys, that's about it. That's really all I, I got to say. Uh, I appreciate everybody watching. Uh, if you guys have any questions at all, please feel free to leave them in the comments section and I'll do my absolute best to respond to all of you uh, as, as fast as humanly possible. Uh, we just recently hit over 100 subscribers, so I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Um, and if you, like I said, if you're new, definitely subscribe. Join the team here. We're, you know, I'm just trying to, you know, help you guys out, and you guys are helping me out. It's a, it's a, it's a great thing. Everybody wins, you know. Um, and also, I created a channel that I do vlogging on uh, called Paid to Drive Vlogs. There'll be a link in the description. Uh, if you wouldn't mind subscribing over there, I'd greatly appreciate it. If you enjoy these videos, I'm assuming you'll enjoy those. Um, I talk about a whole range of topics, so definitely check that out. Uh, I'm trying to get over like 35 subscribers on there if you wouldn't mind. Uh, so yeah, let me know if you subscribed over there. And uh, every day we've been getting like 10 to 15 likes a video. Let's definitely try and keep that up. And uh, that's about it. That's really all I got to say. Today's secret comment code is going to be the money business. Comment the money business down below if you made it to the end of this video. But yeah, folks, there's a lot of potential. You can make a, quite a bit of money with Grubhub. I highly recommend it. And uh, that's going to wrap it up for today. Safe travels, everybody. Keep hustling. Keep making that money. And uh, until next time, peace the hell out. Thanks for watching. And, uh, whoa, I almost hit that guy in front of me. No, I didn't because I'm a safe driver. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys tomorrow here on Paid to Drive. Thanks. See you soon. Later. Woo!